that with just over six weeks to go until Election Day, the race for the White House is closer than ever, especially in the critical battleground states. According to CBS News estimates, Vice President Kamala Harris is holding a narrow edge over former President Donald Trump in several key states. But in a race that could be decided by just a few votes, every state matters. In Arizona, Harris leads Trump by just one point, 50% to 49%. Similar margins show her ahead in Michigan and Wisconsin by two points each, and in North Carolina by just a single point. In Nevada, Harris holds a slightly larger lead at 51% to Trump's 48%, and she's also leading in Nevada's second congressional district, 51% to 47%. But it's not all good news for the Harris campaign. In Pennsylvania, one of the most crucial states, it's a dead heat. Both Harris and Trump are tied at 49%. Meanwhile, Trump is narrowly ahead in Georgia, leading by just 50% to Harris's 49%. Polling expert Nate Silver gives Harris a slight edge in four key states. His model favors Harris to win Michigan with a 63% chance, while she's also favored in Pennsylvania, Wisconsin, and Nevada. According to Silver, Michigan is the one state where Harris can be considered slightly ahead, rather than in a pure toss-up situation. However, both campaigns have to be cautious, especially in Wisconsin, where Trump has defied polling predictions before. The state's massive polling errors in 2016 and 2020 are causing concern for the Harris team. Political expert Andrew Rowe said the election will be decided by the results in a few swing states. The national polls may give Harris an edge, but the swing state polls tell a much tighter story. It's still anyone's game. The key states that will decide the 2024 election include Pennsylvania, Michigan, Wisconsin, Georgia, North Carolina, Nevada, and Arizona. These battlegrounds hold the balance of power, and both campaigns are fighting for every last vote. With just over six weeks until Election Day, the race is on who will come out on top. Stay tuned as we bring you the latest updates from this tight battle for the White House.